Um, proud, of, proud of our guys. I thought, you know, the first half is specifically, uh, we were as locked in as we've been all year defensively. Uh, guys were sticking to the game plan and the scout. Our communication uh, was, was tremendous. And our, um, our rotations were really good. Uh, we, we trapped the post a few times. Uh, so we were just locked in defensively. And then that led to, we haven't converted uh, like we want to this season uh, for, for a full stretch. And I thought for 20 minutes we converted on the other end of the floor offensively. Uh, we attacked when we needed to, uh, slowed it down and executed. Uh, so just proud of our, proud of our efforts. Uh, this guy right here was tremendous. We knew with their pressure it would open up some driving lanes and opportunity. And, and JB did a great job of finishing. Uh, Brock got to the foul line, you know, driving them off closeouts. And so we had to attack the paint. We shot 69% from two. Uh, and that's kind of been a theme in our games versus Detroit. We were f plus 50% from two-point range. So we didn't want to settle for jump shots, even though we took the ones we liked. Uh, so we did a good job attacking there. Uh, and so just proud of our defensive effort. Uh, we were just focused mentally going into this game as a team, uh, defensively, unit on one end of the floor, and it created offense for us. Um, in the second half, uh, we knew that it was going to tighten up the pressure, but we held our composure, and we just played the game that we knew how to play, which is up and down, and uh, we, we ran away with it at the end. That was, that was part of the, uh, again, you know, third time around you see each other, and you kind of see some things you can exploit, and uh, one of the things that we, where we've had success is attacking the paint. Uh, whether it's the post or, or the drive. And so um, our guys were looking for those opportunities, and we did a good job driving it strong. You know, our turnovers were, were in the backcourt a few times, but not many in the half court when we were attacking the lane. And uh, we've been working at that all year, trying to find the balance between, you know, shooting the open threes, uh, but still attacking the paint. Yeah, I thought the beginning of the second half, you know, we got in the bonus very early. I, I looked up and there were 16 fouls early. Uh, part of that was they extended the pressure. Uh, we did a good job handling the basketball. And so uh, we hadn't shot foul shots, you know, at the, at the rate that we did tonight. So I was e extremely happy uh, with our guys mentally to, to lock in. And, and JB going for 9 for 11, Brock 10 for 12. You know, we haven't been a great foul shooting team this season. Uh, but we, we talked about, you know, the way to advance at this point in the, in the game is you got to finish around the rim and you got to make free throws uh, because the jump shots, you know, they'll come and they'll go. Uh, so if we can defend uh, and then finish, you know, and then step up and win the game at the line, you know, I like our chances against anyone. He's a, he's a, he's a load now. He's a really big guy. He's, he's very strong. Uh, and, and we've held him, you know, kind of in check uh, in the other two games. And so we doubled him early. Uh, he did a good job passing out of the double team. Uh, we didn't let him catch it deep. Uh, that was part of the scouting report. And, uh, you know, as they started to hit some threes, we, we took the double off. And uh, Brett Prawl did an amazing job just guarding him one-on-one -on -one, uh, in, in the second half there. And so, but he's a guy that you, you know can get going. You've got to put up a lot of attention to. I uh, thought they went to him to cut it to eight. Uh, they started to throw the ball inside. And, and I loved our response uh, when it got close there. You know, we talked a lot about having a next play mindset. You know, there's going to be runs, uh, but you have to have poise and move on to the next play. And our response at that point in time was critical. Uh, he, JB came out of that huddle and made two free throws, get it back to double figures, and we responded really well. <laughs> uh, my teammates found me in the right position to succeed, so uh, I just owe it all to them and my coaches for putting me in a position to uh, have success. Well, we had a rest and recover. You know, they, they're, um, they're a physical team, maybe the most physical team in our league. And so the time, we, what we do right now with our bodies uh, between now and 8 p.m. tomorrow night is, uh, is of the utmost importance. Uh, so we got to get rested. Uh, I thought, you know, at their place, uh, again, we've had these moments where uh, defensively we, we look like we want to look. Uh, we haven't been able to sustain. And that was one of the games where we did sustain it for almost an entire game. We lost Peters a few times late. Uh, and so you know you got to protect the paint with them. They're big. Uh, they have size on the wings with Hammock. Uh, they got the two big guys inside. But I thought at their place, uh, you know, we, we were phys as physical uh, as they were. We matched the physicality of the game. Yeah, I, 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 I think at this point in the year, um, and we talked about this with our group, is, you know, there's no surprises. It's, it's more personnel. Uh, players got to make plays in March. Uh, JB stepped up for us tonight. 
Uh, they beat Wright State without Alec, and so Shane Hammock stepped up, and, and so they have an extreme amount of talent, and a lot of times uh, when you lose a guy like that, uh, there's this, you know, locker room effect where guys, you know, a lot of guys step up and, and they cover for it, and, and that gives them momentum because nobody believes that they can do it without that individual. And so it's a team game. They have a great program and tradition. Uh, those, those kids aren't going to want to let that standard down, and we know that. So we'll have to, like I said, rest up and be able to match that energy.